My family had an emergency and it really shook me. Hey, and welcome to my channel. In case you're new here, my name is Morgan and I have eight kids and I have been filming YouTube videos for a while now. And if you followed me for any length of time, you might notice that I've been missing for almost six months. And you may be wondering where I've been. <laughs> well, I'm making this video specifically for you to tell you where I've been and why I haven't been around. In December of 2022, my family had an emergency and it really shook me. It shook me like all the way to my core. I believe that privacy for my family is really important. I love sharing things on YouTube and I plan to share a ton of things to encourage you and maybe one day share even this, but I'm just not there yet. So when that happened in December, it completely took every ounce of everything I had just to get through that time. And so I felt like I had to pull back on anything and everything that I was doing that was extra because I didn't have anything extra to give. If you've ever heard the phrase, you can't pour from an empty cup, that's exactly where I was. My cup was empty. Um, I didn't really even have anything to pour into my own kids. And I had seven at home and I needed to pour into them somehow. And so it took like every bit of my strength every single day to get through that and, and be there for them in, in the best way that I could and my ascended family and everything else. So I decided to delete all my social media and delete YouTube and just everything for a while while I walked through that season and it was really difficult. So that's where I was. And then I, when I first did that, I just thought, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do this for like a month. I thought that, you know, I needed a month or so to kind of work through some things. And it ended up being a beautiful, <laughs> beautiful time in my life. I had no social media and it was, it was quiet and I didn't miss it even a little bit. And so I decided to just wait. I had four kids playing basketball at that time and I was just loving getting filled up by their games and their practices and spending time with them and my family. And it was just a really beautiful time. Um, so definitely something really hard turned into something really beautiful. And it took a long time for me to be ready to come back. Well, recently I've been feeling called and led to definitely share some things with a lot of people. My goal for YouTube is to encourage and inspire and teach. And I have a lot to teach and a lot of things that I think I can share. And so I decided I'm gonna come back. And so here I am putting this video out there so that you guys can know I'm, I'm coming back to, to share things I've learned with you guys over the years of me having eight kids and just all the things I've learned through that. I've made a lot of mistakes and my heart is to share all the things that I've learned with all of the mamas that are gonna um, watch these videos. And that way you don't have to make those mistakes. I wish that I had known about YouTube when I had two kids or when I had five kids, five and under, because I, I could have learned a lot from other people. I didn't know about that back then, but I did figure a lot of stuff out the hard way. And so here I am ready to show you guys how to do a lot of things the easy way so that you don't have to go through all the hard things that I did. I felt like it was really important for me to make this video because there are so many of you that have um, asked where I've been or said that you missed me. And I just wanted you to know that that meant the world to me to know that I had encouraged someone or inspired someone or taught someone something. That is my entire goal. And I just wanted to kind of put something short and sweet out there to let you guys know where I've been, because I'm sure that if something like this had happened to somebody that I follow pretty closely on YouTube, I would be wondering where they were. And then if they just started coming back and didn't ever say anything about it, I would wonder, you know, maybe what happened in their life. And although I'm not gonna share the details of what happened, I'm just gonna say that it's okay. If you get into a place in your life where you feel very empty, then it's okay to just do the bare minimum. The bare minimum is enough. Don't ever think you have to do all that extra and stuff like that because you don't, you don't. It's all bonus. And so that's pretty much it. That's where I've been and this is where we're going. So if you're interested, go ahead and subscribe and until next time, go flip your clothes from the washer to the dryer.